for Greg, this question is um, for you. Elon Musk has stated that Berkshire Hathaway's energy proposal for Texas, spending more than $9 billion for new generating capacity, is wrong. Instead, Mr. Musk argues that load balancing using battery storage is the appropriate course of action. Can you explain why the BHE proposal is the better course of action for Governor Abbott in the state of Texas? Specifically, what amount of savings can the citizens of Texas expect above and beyond what Mr. Musk is proposing? Sure. So the... Uh Obviously, there is a very unfortunate event in Texas in, in February, and it basically lasted four days. Many lives were lost. The economic damage was significant. Texas has highlighted that anywhere from 80 to, 80 to $130 billion in incurred losses over that period of time. And I, I think when you look at the power sector, it fundamentally let the citizens down. It didn't perform as, as they expected. And... And then when it did perform, it was extremely expensive. Uh, they, they incurred billions and billions of dollars of, of energy costs versus uh, a multiple of, of, of basically 10 times what they paid. They paid 10 times uh, in energy costs over those four days what they paid uh, uh, <coughs> in, the, in the past year. So a very substantial event for, for Texas. We've, we've gone to Texas with what we believe is a good solution. Uh, we spent a lot of time pulling it together, understanding the, the fundamental issues around it. And our proposal is really based upon the fact that the, the health and welfare of, of Texans were at risk and, and we needed to have effectively an insurance policy in place for them. That if they needed the power on very short notice, it would be able to be dispatched and it would be there for the, the four days we're actually proposing it could be there for, for seven days. And the, and the fund, fundamental concept of our proposal has always been if there's a better proposal that's brought forward, we've accomplished our mission. We've just been really there to, uh, it's, the, it's the best proposal or option we could come up with and, and obviously if Texas or or Elon or someone else comes up with a, a better proposition, we've always said, Texas, you should pursue it. Um, we strongly believe right now we have a, what remains is a very good good proposal for Texas and it'll continue to be discussed and, and evaluated. The big difference between a battery proposal and our proposal is that we will have power that can be generated continuously for um, seven consistent days, where if you went to a battery solution, you may release that power that's been stored for four hours, but we're talking four days of a, of a problem, not four hours. And, and it's just a completely different cost equation and, and solution. So very proud that our teams brought forward uh, uh, what I thought was a very unique solution. We've worked hard with uh, our, our suppliers and, and Peter Kew and Sons to put together what we believe is a, a firm cost that, uh, that can also be delivered by November of 23. So again, we put a firm date on. Uh, it won't be ready next winter, unfortunately. It won't be ready this summer, but it's, uh, it's a valuable solution and one that uh, we hope at least leads to the right discussion and the right long-term solution for the state. Yeah, and we're, we're also willing to put up $4 billion that if we don't deliver when we say we're going to deliver, uh, we'll, we'll pay it as, as a penalty, basically. And, and uh, uh, But, you know, we went to Kiwit. We went to General Electric and said, you know, how long can we get turbines? And, you know, for that, it, it, we, it, you know it, if you're going to be prepared for 2023, it, you have to start at a point fairly soon and you have inflation going on and and Kiwi's not going to change things on us in a month. We don't, we don't try to get the contracts all written out, but we they had 100 people working on it. Or yeah, they had like hundreds it. working yeah. on it. And, 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 you know, and GE's cooperative and everything. But it doesn't mean we have the best solution. We just know what we can do. And and if anybody can do it faster, they can do it cheaper, you know, whatever. That's terrific. Uh, but they, they should have something to lose, though, if they don't do it. I mean, uh, uh, and, no. and we will back our promise up by $4 billion, which, uh, you know, and, and we won't have any rinky-dink clauses in there that, that if this happens or that happens, we don't pay. Well, so, 
But we won't be able to do that a year from now. I mean, we can do it a year from now with the cost then from what they are then, and then it'll be a year further out. But we, we want Texas. Texas is a terrific place to do business. We do a lot of business there, and it's where BNS SF is headquartered. We, and it's, it's a great place. And, uh, and this was out of the blue, but one way or another, the, the nature of, of, of utility business is that you got to, you have to be prepared for something that probably isn't going to happen. <laughs> and yep. be, you know, you don't want to say it's a, well, it's a one in 30 year event, you know, and, and, and people die. I mean, it's so, uh, you want, you want a margin of safety in it. And, and we've got one solution and other people may have other solutions and, and we will, we will cheer when a solution is re reached of any kind and we will cheer a little louder if it's ours. <laughs>